Coach, a lot going on with the program. Very exciting time. Um, today, uh, it was just announced that we're going to be playing over in the Barclays Center uh, in the Winter Festival next December against uh, against St. John's. Uh, what are your thoughts about, about that opportunity? Well, we're honored to, to be able to play in the Barclays Center in, in the first season that they'll be open. Um, I think it's a, a great thing to be able to play a team like St. John's there. And uh, to be able to play them in Brooklyn, where they, they originated and where we're from, uh, I think it's great for local college basketball. I really think it, it it's a, a great time to be here at, in the city coaching. And I think it's going to, you know, having Madison Square Garden and now the Barclays Center, I think it's really going to just help local college basketball tremendously. How about for our program? you see any um, advantages, you know, going uh, down the line uh, for us? Yeah, well, I, I think having the ability to play in the Barclays Center, whether it be against a local competition, a league competition, or a national competition, it is a great advantage for us. And, and hopefully it will give us the, the opportunity to attract some teams to come play here uh, that we wouldn't be able to do if we didn't have that venue. Just today, uh, some great news from the Northeast Conference. Stefan Perunicic was named the Northeast Con Conference Scholar Athlete of the Year. Uh, you know. What does that mean to to our program to have a kid like Steph um, come out of our program and to, and to get an honor like that? Well, first of all, it's a tremendous accomplishment for Steph. He, he took his academics very seriously when he was here um, and did a great job. He finished with a very high GPA and and deserves to be recognized for that. In addition to that, he had a very good career on the basketball court, and I thought he really improved uh, as, as he moved forward. Um, so we're, we're very proud of him. We're very excited that he got the award. Uh, very happy for him. It's well-deserved, and, and it's something he truly earned. I think it, it's a testament to our program as well with the type of guys we're, we have playing here. Uh, I, I think our guys, I really like being around them, and I, I think it's a group that the school could be very proud of. Now some other uh, great news. Some of our, our former players, Ricky Cadell and Akeem Bennett, have started to have some success in playing overseas uh, professionally. Uh, you know, talk about um, ha being able to put some, some former players uh, in the professional ranks. And what well, it, it's great. I think it, it helps us in recruiting that we, we have guys who are playing after college professionally. I know it's been a dream of those guys uh, since they were little. So to be able to realize that dream and, and be able to play professionally overseas, it, it's great. Uh, I couldn't be happier for those guys. It, and it's so tough to get a, get a job overseas nowadays. It's different. It, you know, the market is very competitive. Um, and the fact that they were both able to play uh, and, and have success this year is a testament to their abilities. And finally, uh, a current player of ours, uh, Ben Mockford, is going to have an opportunity to try out in his native uh, Great Britain for his uh, development team. And, and, and what do you see as... Uh, um, you know that being able to do for Ben to be able to to compete at that level. I think any kid that can compete on a national team level uh, in the summer is a, a tremendous advantage, um, and I think Ben he puts a lot into it. He worked very hard to get ready for the camp. Uh, he's been in the gym a lot uh, before he left, and it's it's an opportunity for him to get a couple of weeks in against high level competition and to be pushed by coaches. Um, in the off season, which I think will benefit him next year. Uh, we're very excited for him. We hope he can make the team, but even if he doesn't, I think just the experience of going through the tryouts and, and competing against those guys is going to really help him next year. Thanks very much, Coach.